What's good, everybody, and welcome back to s &G with me, A.B. Now, check it out. You guys seen that thumbnail. You know what we're making. Here it is right here. Listen, I'm not going to over-talk this intro. We about to get it. Now, check it out. You guys can see not a whole lot of ingredients, right? But I do want to talk about this right here. Look, this is 33% less sodium in the soy sauce. This is key, especially for those of us that are watching our salt intake. But don't forget, all of the ingredients with the measurements will be down in the description box below. What you want to do is get yourself a bowl, right? And this is really like a dump and go. So we'll just, no particular order. Everything that you see right here goes into the bowl. So we got our soy sauce. And then I'm gonna talk about this too, you guys. You guys gotta make sure you got the right tools for the job. I say that in every, you know, uh, quite a few of my videos. Look how much and how easy this is by having a small, you know, rubber spatula. Look, I'm able to get all of my ingredients out. I use hot sauce, you guys can use sriracha. It does, you know, use whatever little taste you would like. But I like the little bite from the, uh, you know, from the hot sauce. Now, get yourself a whisk. We got our bowl. I'll bring this over here like this. And this is what we want. This is our sauce, folks. Now I'm just going to go ahead and dice these in the look. look. Notice the angle. Normally, I cut them like this, right? But I'm going to start this way. So we want to just go like this. And then look at, the, look at the cut on it. We doing something fancy, folks. You see that? I brought my cast iron skillet. I put it on the stove because I wanted to get it nice and preheated, right? So we under medium high heat. Look, I got branch and vine. These are my infused olive oils, right? This right here, look at this right here. This is my butter infused. So we're going to bring this up to heat. But I, again, look, I started out getting my, my material hot and now we go here, right? You just want to put some in here like that. Now this is already warm. I've adjusted everything. I'm going to go ahead and take this, move this out the way. We just want to move it around. Make sure it completely coats it, right? Once you see it starts to shimmer, it might try to smoke on you. Like you can see just a little bit of the smoke right there. Now you want to go ahead and get your salmon, right? Now that I got my salmon, this is key. We're going to start because we're only going to flip it once, right? We're going to start with the flesh side up. So we'll just put it in right here. Key is with the salmon, we don't want to like overcook it, right? So I'm gonna lower this heat down to a low. And what we want to do is we want to get the skin side down and start letting that get crisp. So I got one of these spatulas, you know, these say these, these are made for uh, fish. So we'll just go underneath the bottom. Once you get them flipped, then you want to come back to your sauce, right? Check this out. Now we're going to just start adding our sauce. Let me get it over here so you guys can see. Let's put it on like this. Now remember, we lowered that heat. We got a, a real low, you know? That right there smells incredible. Then you can get yourself a spoon and just start spooning it over the top. With the heat, you see it starting to thicken up. Now you wanna take your sesame seeds and just wanna just like, you know, sprinkle some over the top. Then we'll come with a little green onion over the top. Get ourselves another spoon. Just spoon right over the top of the green onions too. And remember, the longer we let it cook, you know, at that low temperature, it starts to thicken up this teriyaki sauce. And for me, I'm gonna serve this over a bed of rice. We finna eat healthy, folks. I'm gonna go ahead and turn this off. I 
know you guys seen this. You gotta let me know what you think about the presentation. I'm gonna talk about, look, the sauce, right? The sauce, homemade, it beats anything that you're gonna buy. And the fact that it's low sodium, you know, 33% less sodium, we can control that, right? So if you wanna add something to it, you can. But I promise you, this right here is fire. Now, if you look right here, I just got myself some rice. You know what, you can serve it over rice. You can serve this along with some veggies. But this here, go ahead and just take it like this. Oh yeah, look at that right there. This looks nice, this, to me this is a nice presentation and it's super healthy, but wait, I gotta say this. When I say super healthy, listen, when we using these infused olive oils and it's the same thing with, uh, it's gonna be the same thing with just regular extra virgin olive oil, look, these are the healthier fats. So if you guys trying to eat better, minus this rat, ri uh, rice right here, all you gotta do is make this, look, you got veggies, you got some salmon, you got that healthy fat on it and this right here what makes it fire. Hey. I feel like my mouth is, uh, ain't no feel like, I know my mouth is watering. I'm not finna ramble, cause it, ooh, it smells incredible. So I'ma go ahead and get me some right now. Oh yeah, it's real nice, folks. I'ma, yeah, you know what? I'ma bring it in so you guys can see. Let's do it like this. Like this. Get underneath it. And then look, you can see where it's been cooked. Look, look at that. Now you guys can cook it if you want an extra crispy, you know, uh, skin, just cook them a little longer. But with that being said, folks, Cheers. It ain't fair, folks. It ain't Kool-Aid, but I did say earlier, we got to be healthy, right? If you take a look at this plate right here, that'll go to show you. Look, when we cut this, that's what happened. Super good. If you guys are new to my channel, let me just take this time to say, hey, Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, hit that subscribe button and tell everybody out there, this channel is making these fire recipes. And with that being said, I'm out.